Hello friends, I'm Parways and this is our 8th video in WX Python GUI application development. In the previous video, we have covered how you can create button and also we have talked about event handling in WX Python. Uh, this is from the previous video. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can create toggle buttons in WX Python. So I have created a new Python file and I'm going to copy my uh, window and panel code uh, from my previous videos and just paste it in here and now I'm going to change the title to uh, to toggle button like this and you can see uh, I have imported WX and I have a class my frame and in the my frame and after my frame I have a panel and also I have a my app okay now in the panel I'm going to create the toggle button first I need to create uh, v box uh, vertical box layout uh, wx dot box sizer uh, wx dot vertical okay and after this uh, now I'm going to create a label uh, self uh, dot label uh, wx dot static text and now it needs some parameters the first one is self and the label is right now I'm going to just give a hello uh, after come uh, creating my application I will remove this hello uh, now I'm going to add the label uh, to my vertical box layout and you can simply uh, self dot label and also expand this dot expand like this okay uh, now after this I'm going to create a toggle button uh, self dot toggle and uh, self dot toggle uh, I'm going to btn now wx dot toggle button <coughs> now give it self and for the label I'm going to uh, just uh, click to on click to on okay now just add your this uh, toggle button to your vertical box layout dot add uh, self dot toggle button okay now set your vertical box layout uh, self dot set sizer to the v box uh, now if I run this uh, and you will see that I have uh, okay uh, now I have uh, click to on uh, right now there is no functionality for this toggle button now I am going to uh, create uh, for this I need to create a new uh, sorry okay now I'm going to create a new method in here uh, Diff uh, on toggle click okay uh, now first I'm going to create a state and I want to get the uh, event object uh, from my this event uh, parameter so I'm going to create a state variable in here and I'm going to take uh, the get event object event dot get event object and I'm going to get the value of that like this and after this time I'm going to uh, create a if a statement and I'm going to check this if a state is true okay if it is true so now I'm going to self dot label dot set text set label text just write I'm going to write off and I'm going to create this off and event uh, dot get 
event object and also I'm going to change the label of this let me just copy this in here and paste it in here dot set label to click to off okay now in the else statement uh, I'm going to check the uh, false condition else okay uh, else uh, if it's false now I'm going to self dot label dot set label not dimmed enable dot set label text to the on and I'm going to just copy this event dot get event object and uh, just write this click to on okay uh, now I'm going to bind my this event uh, to my toggle button now at the top uh, this is our code now in here where we have our toggle button we are going to uh, self dot toggle button dot bind okay now we need a wx dot toggle button event evt uh, toggle button and the method is self uh, this is the method let me just copy this and paste it in here okay now this is our complete code uh, you can check this and let me run this okay now this is our application and let me just uh, clear this hello from here because uh, we don't need to this hello okay now I'm going to run this okay uh, now if I click on this off and uh, now it's telling me click to off now if I click on this on on off on off this is toggle button uh, thank you guys if you have any question please let me know and for the further videos please subscribe to my channel and also like the videos